Hello adventurers and welcome. I'm going to turn that down because that is a bit loud for me. Hello everybody. Alrighty. This is a game called Sophia. It's kind of a, as you could tell from the warning before, it's a bit of a darker game. Um, and I did play a little bit of little bit of it before, but um, I'm going back to just starting over and because I don't remember anything that I did previously. Uh, <laughs> and we're just gonna get into it. I do remember noting that the art was pretty and that I liked the color scheme. But that's all about I remember, so let's go. You there? No. Lol. Guess what? What? Ooh, ooh. You know what's tomorrow? Oh, I couldn't read the other thing. No, tomorrow is our one month anniversary. XD. Er, colon D. Oh, who are you again? Hmm. You know I was not gonna invite you over, but now I don't know. I don't know. Hmm. Sorry. Hmm. Okay. 6 p.m. You better be on time. This is our one month anniversary boyfriend, Fio. And he is adorable as sin. Welcome to my place. I hope you like it. <laughs> anyway, why don't I start preparing dinner? You go ahead and make yourself at home. Alright, move with those keys, interact with inner, use shift to sprint. Um. I might, well, let me see if I can interact with spacebar, because if I can, that'd just be easier. Yes, I can. Okay. That just makes this easier for me with my microphone set up. All right, this drawer seems to have been repurposed as a shoe rack. Yep. Oop. Can I look at this? Nope. Okay. And as most games, I look at the plant. I can't look, I can't look at the plant? How very rude. All right, this is the first floor bathroom. Can't look at the plant. What kind of trickery is this? A fairly faded bathroom sink. Toilet. You don't need to use this right now. Hmm. Who are you to tell me when I can't use a toilet? That's just very rude. All right, let's look at the calendar, see what date it is. Ye old 2010. Uh, <laughs> um, let's see. It looks like there's a concert on the 13th. Uh, it looks like in between the. Uh, it looks like the 11th and the 14th. They're gonna be out of town. And then the second says Annie, so I'm wondering if today is Feb- not Feb- oh gosh, not February. April 2nd, maybe? I'm not sure. Alright. Yes. Let's go this way. Locked door. Cool. Can't do much about that. It's a shelf- uh, the shelf is filled to the brink with different books. Just at a glimpse, they look complicated. Can I- no, okay, just that one thing. Look at the TV. It's a drawer. There's probably tableware inside. Can I look at the TV? 
No, just the drawer. Okay. Couch? Nope. Alright, let's see if we can go upstairs before we go to the kitchen. Oh, I don't want to soup around too much. Okay. So first things first, we go to the kitchen. Let's look through his trash. His trash can is empty. Let's look in the fridge. The fridge is filled to the brim with fresh ingredients. Hmm? Oh, gee. It smells burnt. Oh, no, baby. Don't startle me like that. What? No, no, I don't need any help. I have everything under control. <laughs> you just go ahead and wait for me in the living room. I'll be right there. Alright, well. I think to be able to wait in the living room for him, we need to sit at the table. So I think we sit here. Wait here until dinner. Yes. Sorry for the wait. You ended up eating instant ramen. Oh no. I'm sorry, I couldn't make you something more fancy. Oh, it didn't matter which chair I sat in. Sophia's going to kill me if she finds out. Hmm? Who Sophia is? Uh, she looks after me while my parents are on their trip. I, I thought I told you before. Oh, okay, so the parents are gone between the 11th and the 14th. It's too bad she isn't home tonight. She really wanted to meet you. So I'm guessing we're high school age, probably. Uh, maybe middle school, the youngest. Oh, don't worry. I'm sure she'd love you. You are a sweet, handsome, and talented guy. Don't give me that look. We both know you'll be super famous real soon. <laughs> I'll always be your number one fan, though. After finishing your meal, you clean up after yourselves and head back to the living room. Let's go upstairs. We'll show you my room. Just look at that cute. Hold on. We can look at that cute little sweater. That's so cute. And he has a little kitty face. All right. Well, I think the best course of action would just be to go to his room, which I believe is over here. Because I believe we can explore around a little bit later. This is my room. Ah, I'm so nervous. I know, I know. So much pink. It's the book that you've been meaning to read once Fia was finally done with it. It's a picture of you and Fia on your first date. Pretty flowers. A vase full of flowers. They smell lovely. Few books are stacked neatly away on the drawer. This isn't the time to read. This bush is in full bloom, submerging the room in a rosy scent. Thankfully, there are some plants we can interact with, darn it. It wouldn't be an RPG Maker game if you could not interact with plants. <laughs> a big bear. It has a very calm face. Oh, yeah, no, I'm gonna... I wanna smoosh, I wanna smoosh that bear. Television, it's an old school TV. Do you want to play a game? Uh, yeah, I want to play a game. Come here, you. I've got you cornered now. Bam! <laughs> you died. One more, one more. You play a few more rounds. That was fun. And I'm not just saying that because you- I totally whooped your ass. Oh, that little cocky son of a gun. It is my most played game though, so no need to feel bad. Well. Do you want to head to bed? Um, 
Yeah, it's getting a little late. It's already like really dark outside. Let's go to bed. Alrighty, I'm pretty pooped as well. You head into bed. Crow? Oh good, you're still awake as well. Yo, I'm so glad I finally got to invite you over. Sometimes I wake up and think that I just made you up and in my dream. For a moment, I get really sad. But tomorrow I won't have to worry about that, because I'll wake up next to you. <laughs> Maybe we'll visit each other in our dreams tonight. Do you believe in things like that? I see. You didn't really strike me as the type anyway. We're a realist. <laughs> Personally, well, I want to believe in it. Things like soulmates and connections, maybe even fate. I'm just a helpless romantic, I suppose. You don't say. Oh, I don't believe in horoscopes, though. They've always lied to me in the past. You're right. We should try to sleep now. Good night. Love you. Ah, no. It's rules of a slumber party where you have to talk while the lights are out in bed for at least 30 minutes to an hour before you eventually all kind of fall asleep. That's just how it goes. <laughs> Closing your eyes, you slowly drift off into sleep. noises or maybe he went to the bathroom hmm you are woken by a strange noise the bed next to you is empty maybe he went to the toilet okay um, I'm just gonna save over my previous save spot just cuz wait hold on let me make sure that actually s I guess I have to okay yeah I did save okay just making sure uh, you know what I d I'm paranoid I'm gonna save right there all right onward all right that door's locked so he's not in there I just want to check this way first nope well here's the upstairs bathroom he's not in here a fairly faded bathroom sink, just like the other one. Do I need a potty? I actually needed to use the toilet. Well, now I have to wash my fan. It won't let me wash my hands! Okay. It's gotten a lot of use over the years. That, that tends to happen when people need to bathe regularly. Is he this way? That way is locked. I will look in this closet real quick if I can. A closet. Not your favorite thing in the world. Go downstairs, see if we can find our boo. Did he go to the downstairs toilet? No. Okay. Maybe the kitchen? Get some water? That's not good that it's moving on its own. Theo is nowhere to be found. Hmm? You decide to head back to bed. That's probably the smart option. The sound seems to have come from the living room. That... I can't tell because RPG Maker sound effects, but that might have sounded like a gun, maybe? Or something falling. Oh no, it was a gun! Oh! Oh baby boy, no!
Before you lies a motionless body that was once someone treasured. All you can do is stare in horror, wondering if there was nothing you could do. But no god is answering your pleas tonight. Oh. first or well anniversary date sleepover I oh goodness oh that's a cute photo oh This is a flashback, I think. And here's your share for the evening. Ah. Uh, what? Don't tell me you expected more. Huh? I didn't. Don't make me laugh. A no name like you should go should be glad to be given anything. Just being real with you, kid. I know your kind comes to the city expecting to make it big immediately, but that just ain't how it works. Right. Whatever. My advice is clearly wasted here. If you're done here, scram. That was rude. I didn't even say anything. Um. Hmm? Oh, it's you. So you really did show up, huh? Of course. It was great. So, don't let that meanie get to you. He must have overheard us just now. Thanks, but I'm fine. Got some pretty thick skin. So that means you'll keep playing? Yeah. Oh, look at that little blush. Good. Thank thanks again for inviting me. Um. Hmm? Do you have any plans right now? Nope. Why? Well, if you haven't had dinner yet, we could go and get some. Only if you want. <gasps> I'd love that! Oh, we're back on the train. You must have fallen asleep on the train. You wonder how much time has passed. Your stop must be coming up soon. Hey! Glad you can make it. Come on in. Welcome to my home. I hope you like it. <laughs> anyway, I'll start preparing dinner and you go ahead and make yourself at home. This is deja vu. We have done this before. Um, let me relook at everything, I guess. Okay, yep. Okay, let's see if there's anything different from last. Oh, there is a spot on the floor where he obviously died. That's... I can't, I can't look at the obvious different spot that's obviously from where a stain was. Okay. Uh, well, let's look at the calendar and see if anything's changed. It did change. Uh... Stop throwing away my snacks. Stop buying them. Dental appointment on the 28th. Road trip from the 21st to 25th. Uh, rental deadline on the 7th. And then Annie on the 2nd. So I'm not quite sure what that means since I know our name is Crow. 
Um, I'm assuming all of the stuff in the red is things that Fio has written, and the other pen marks are probably either his parents or this Sophia person. Alright, well that did change. Alright, I don't want to soup around too much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, well let's see what I can actually... It's a drawer. Okay. So we might just need to go visit our boo. What is this in the corner? No, it's just part of the flooring. Okay. Hmm? Oh boy. It smells burnt. <gasps> Whoa, you startled me. What? Me? Need help? <laughs> nah. You just head and go ahead and relax in the living room. I'll be there in a moment. Alright, well, let me see if there's anything in the trash. Alright, it's empty. Still? Well, I don't know if I can click on anything else, so I will wait at the table until dinner. Um, I feel like this is going to have some time loop shenanigans. And I'm totally fine with that because I love that kind of thing. <clears throat> Sorry for the wait. You ended up eating instant ramen. Again. <laughs> I can't get enough of this stuff. Yes, yes, I know it's unhealthy. Sophia always throws my cup ramen away and gives me a lecture afterwards. So I get to hear that a lot. Just how does she keep figuring out my secret hiding spots? One day I'll get back at her and re revenge all those wasted noodles. Oh, I think you mean avenge, sweetie. Mm. Throwing good food away is equally as bad after all, don't you think? I mean, yeah, it's bad for you, but in a pinch, ramen can keep you sustained for a hot minute. <laughs> well, good thing she's not here today. We get to eat all the junk food that we want. Mm -hmm. Uh, fine. We'll eat more healthy next time. After finishing your meal, you clean up after yourselves and head back to the living room. Let's head upstairs. I can't wait to show you my room. I'm not going to talk about the obvious stain on the carpet. I might as well see if I can look in the closet. The closet. Okay, it's the same one as before. Okay, those cracks in the wall weren't there before, I don't think. Alright, that door's locked as well. Okay. No, oh, there are different things in here now. This is my room. Sorry, it's a little messy. Can I look at the pictures? Oh, no. Okay, that's the book thing again. Can you play video games again? Um... We've already played video games before, so I'll say no. No, nope, can't look at the tissue, so let's just go to bed. Sure, I'm also pretty tired. You head into bed. Crow? Are you also having a hard time falling asleep? Oh, now that I think about it, you've mentioned that it takes you longer. Do you ponder a lot? Me? <laughs> I don't have much to ponder. Sometimes I stay up reading something super exciting before bed, and then I'll keep thinking about it and can't fall asleep. But I know that's not the same. Well, Theo, that's when you keep reading the thing until your eyes fall out. That's what I did when I was your age, anyways. Just keep reading the thing. Especially if it's a mystery. You just, you kind of have to keep reading. <laughs> if there's something on your mind you want to talk about, let me know. I'll never know what it's like to be in your position, but I still want to support you as much as I can. I know you're a strong person, but if there's something I can do to lift your burdens, I want to do it. So, um, let me know. I'll be there. Theo is just so sweet. <laughs> ah, that reminds me. I still haven't finished that book. I'll let you know as soon as I'm done. Promise. 
You're a lot more tired than you realized. Closing your eyes, you slowly drift off into sleep. You wake up in the middle of the night to a slight headache. You decide to go fetch a cup of water. And we're gonna save again, because something bad's probably gonna happen again. I still wanna try and look at things to see if I can... Okay, it's still locked. So let's just do what we're supposed to do, go downstairs and get some water. To the sink. After drinking a cup of tap water, you feel a little better. So I'm just gonna type trash, just. It's empty, but we had instant ramen. There should be ramen cups in there. Oh, that was a person. Oh, that was a person. Hold on, let me, let me see if this is unlocked now. Nope, it's still locked. Okay, let's go back upstairs, because that was a person going upstairs. Uh, and that's not good for our for our bubby, Theo. Theo's gone. Theo is nowhere to be seen. Something about this situation feels familiar to you. That's not nerve wracking at all. You have a feeling you should look for him. Yeah, no kidding. Now let's just start room by room. All right, that one's still locked. I'm paranoid, so I'm gonna look in the closet. No, oh, there are dusty coats and scarfs in this closet. They look like they haven't been worn in years. But, what are the, I mean, okay, no one in the bathroom. Maybe in this corner? That area's locked. It seems like this door isn't locked by a key, but rather by some sort of padlock. However, you don't know what the code could be. Okay, so we have to find a code for a door. Ooh, I don't want to go in the kitchen. I'm scared. Okay, no one's in the kitchen. That's good. Front room, maybe? Oh, let's check and see if this is locked. Still. That's still locked. Let's check the front room. Uh, no one's in here either. Maybe out the front door? No? Okay. I've checked everywhere. Is anything the calendar changed? Nope. Okay. Let me go back upstairs, I guess. Maybe he went back to the room? Nope. Okay, there's the TV. We can actually just go back to bed. <laughs> you decide to head back to bed. You're probably just seeing things. Or so you tell yourself as you slowly doze off again. Yeah, I mean, there was nothing that we could actually do. I don't think. Ooh, we gonna get... Got. Sophia? Oh, is that the game? I'm not sure if this is actually the game or if there's more stuff that we can do. Maybe do, um, I don't know, maybe play again to see if we can do something else? Or I'm not sure.
So I'm guessing going back to bed just stops the story. So there may be some things that I could actually do. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> the end. Mm. Oh, and the game just closed out automatically. Uh, let me pull it back up really quick <laughs> to see if there's anything else that we can do. Um, um, okay, there has to be more because there's this. We've only seen that, 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 but not that or that. So there has to be more. Let's see if I can get through. Can I? I can't skip this bit. Um, so maybe there's some things that I can try. Maybe the padlock for certain things. Okay. Uh, oh, what is what is white room? Oh, okay. So that's something that you can. Okay, cool. Uh, keep going. I'm at this. Oh, and was I at this same spot? I don't know. Okay, well, we're back here. Let me see, can I just go back to bed? No, I have to go get the water. Okay, well, let me go get the water. And then we'll see. Well, actually, you know what? Let me see if... Um, here, let me load. Maybe this one. Oh, no, it's the same load spot just from my previous game, I think. Oops. I still have to go get water. <laughs> Yep, there's a sparkle telling us to get water. Okay, I feel better. Creepy person going that way. Go back to our boo. Who's not there? <gasps> Where could Theo be? getting flashbacks to the gunshot wound to the head. Okay, maybe there are some things we can do to maybe... Let me look at the padlock again. Maybe... That one date that stayed the same is locked. Seems to have keys or padlock. Don't want to close the B. Oh, so I have to find that. Okay. Um, well, let's see. Probably maybe the bookshelf. See if there's anything in here. Just a glimpse. They're complicated. Unfortunately, it's too dark to read any of the contents. Okay, and then I don't know where the light switch is. Open the drawer. Ah, here we go. Uh, the upper drawer. Cutlery. Uh, yes. Let's fill in the lower drawer. Small tools, rubber bands, and batteries. Okay, I feel like we'll probably need those batteries maybe for a flashlight. Trash is empty. Can we use the kitchen drawer? Can we look in the kitchen? Can't look in the kitchen drawer. Okay. Can I look on the counter? No. Look back in the fridge. Okay. Fresh food items. Can't click on the couch. That's still locked. Can't look at the table. The calendar again. Um, I would assume padlock combo is maybe the this date right here. Oh, an anniversary. Oh my god. I'm a silly. I'm a silly. I thought that was someone's name, but it's this is today's date. It's just our anniversary. Okay. Oh, there's a sparkle here that I didn't notice. 
Yes, I will open the drawer. It's filled with shoe polish, pocket umbrellas, and a flashlight. There we go. I can think of somewhere the flashlight would be of use. Upon closer inspection, it appears that there are no batteries in the flashlight. Well, I know where the batteries are. Ha ha. Oh, I'm just a silly and just didn't notice the twinkles. Smaller drawer. And I want the batteries. Batteries, old, but giving the faintest of flare, you should use it sparingly. Alright, shelves full to bring a different book, just something feels complicated. Most books are revolving around theories on human psychology. One book sticks out to you, as the exterior is remarkably worn, to the point where some of the words on the cover have completely faded. Deja vu, the use of electrical impulses to blank blank blank. Author, Dr. Marilyn T. Johnson. Deja vu, huh? Many believe deja vu to be subconscious memories provoked by similar past events. Another theory states that deja vus are the result of an electric malfunction within the brain, wrongly appointing a current memory as a past memory, therefore creating a dissonance in the recipient. After collecting data from a vast pool of test subjects, it was found that the electrical pulses of some recipients could be measured during the occurrence of deja vu. There was a trend linked to traumatic experiences and negative emotions within the test subjects that enabled these impulses. Furthermore, after artificially replicating these pulses within the qualified test subjects, some reported new memories of events they couldn't have witnessed. Some researchers claim that these memories are proof of, of other world theories. However, there is yet to be any substantial evidence of such claims. My research showed that this is where the book ends. Are the pages torn? Oh, it appears as if someone carefully removed the remaining pages. That's not sketchy as hell. Can I? Okay, no, that just gets me to click to an area. I thought I could click on the flashlight. Maybe let's go here. It's still locked. Okay, let's go back upstairs. Actually, you know what? I think, looking at the recording mark, I'm going to end right here, and I will see you all again in a part two. Thank you so much for watching, um, and I can't wait to see where this goes. Stay safe, adventurers!